Hey y'all, how you guys doing? Welcome to the vlog and welcome to Get It Right by T. I'm sitting in my glam room. I love this space, but there are some improvements I'm gonna be making. So if you guys want to follow me along for that journey for ideas or just to watch and observe, go ahead and subscribe to my channel by hitting the subscribe button. And don't forget to like the video if you found value in anything I say or do or talk about today. This is a top the tail bar um open with me box opening whatever he had a drop last week on Monday and it is a week from Monday that he had the drop and I was on the site at 8.59, no, 9.59, waiting for 10 o'clock. And I hit refresh, boom, the bag I wanted was still there. And I got it, so we're about to open it up. I'll give you the deeds after I open it. never carry this as a handbag but I would definitely carry it as a travel bag or specifically a bag for work okay so this is it I am very 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 pleased I'm very um, impressed by the structure of it and yeah let me know what you guys think in the comments and I want to know what Telfar you guys like want or currently own Okay, so you guys saw me open my brand new tail beezy. I want to know what you think about it down in the comments because I've been looking for a nice, durable, cute work bag. So, of course, I went to the site and they were sold out and I just was waiting for, I signed up for their emails because I'm not, I wasn't currently signed up with them. Whenever I buy a Telfar, I would like buy it off a friend or family member that had and subscribed to get a notification when he was dropping this um signature collection again and about two weeks later i got an email that they were dropping in a couple days and i made the decision that i was gonna buy it so that bag was 216 dollars that was free shipping was included in that price yeah i think if you spend over 200 you get free shipping and they also had a belt and a bucket hat to match it i did order the bucket hat but it's not here yet so i headed to work after i did that opening with you guys and here is just some footage of me arriving at work getting out the car and getting myself together when i arrive at school i usually settle in and just kind of get comfortable um, put my apron on and establish what part of the lesson planning I'm going to be implementing on this particular day I get my walkie and I head out so that little montage of what you saw was me pulling up and just kind of like settling into my room while um putting on like my apron and all that stuff get grabbing my walkie i am currently at our cart and i am gonna pick out some activities for the kids to do um and i actually have a level of energy that's probably like at about 
I don't know, it's a good level of energy. So I'm gonna let them paint today. Very calming. So I got some cups, I've got some paint. One of my fellow co-workers came up and started talking to me and obviously I was not going to film her. Here's some footage of the kitties going home. <sighs> okay y'all, done with that. I just sent my kiddos off to carpool and I'm going home. <laughs> oh my gosh. I work with kids that are um, five and six and so they're somewhere between baby and grown person and they think that they kind of can do what they want because they are encouraged to be independent but sometimes you gotta draw some lines I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Thank you so much for being here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you on the next one.